Was it a bullish or bearish day on Wall Street? Mark the Meerkat Suffering in for Des with the Broad Market Review for June the 17th, 2015. Well, it was a bullish day and a bearish day and then ended up being a doji day uh, for some of the markets today. Pretty wild with that Fed announcement this afternoon. Uh, let's take a look here at the numbers. So we've got the S&P 500 up 0.16, just barely up. Uh, the Dow up 0.15. The Qs were up 0.28, so they were a little bit stronger. But look at this, the small caps, the YWM. It was down 0.14, and Bank was down 1.38. That is very bearish, even though three of the four markets were up today. Why? Didn't seem to like the Fed announcement that they're going to delay their possible increase in interest rates until September, December, or maybe till 2016. They were very vague about when. Then we get the VIX down to 0.32. Two, which is not enough to confirm the move up. We have silver up and we have uh, gold up and oil was down just to 0.25 percent. All right let's take a look here at the S&P 500. So here's the SPY daily chart and it is a doji, just a doji here. It uh, was interesting to let's take a look at the five minute chart from the SPY for the day. So here we have the S&P 500 five minute chart. You can see here this yellow line was the opening. We gapped up here and then it uh, based for a while and then just about noontime, bam, 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 we went into the negative on the day and then it was low basing down here right on the 200 period moving average. That's again on the five minute chart. And then there was the Fed announcement and Boom! Look at that, Poppy. Look at that. We're not going to increase our interest rates. And look at the volume. Ooh, doggies, that's big. And this again, five-minute chart. And then it was whipping all around here. And here we get them up into uh, 3 o'clock. And then they started to think about what they had to say. And then the market started to fade out a little bit. And there they closed right about where it opened. Right here's where it opened. Right there's where it closed. That's why we ended up with the doji. So let's go back to the daily chart. And on the daily chart again we are in the middle of this rising wedge on the daily chart and right at closed right at the 50 moving average. So and that kind of been neutral not a bullish or bearish. Let's take a look here at the, uh, at the Dow. It's in this symmetrical triangle we talked about yesterday. Inside of that a bit of not quite a doji more of a spinning top here. But again it closed uh, right at the 100 moving average. Then let's take a look here at the Qs. And the Qs, uh, you know, again, big of a spinning top here. And we're close just above that 50 moving average. And then the small caps, as we mentioned, it was uh, up here at all time highs. It's touching all, it could have closed at all time highs, but nope. Ended up closing to the downside uh, uh, back inside of this ascending triangle. Well, uh, here's one other stock I'd like to show you that uh, has been one of my favorites here the last few months, AMBA. I mean, we've been uh, making some calls on this in the uh, Rockstar uh, V newsletter here. And look at this run here. This was one fabulous run here. And it just came to a little bit of a bull flag here. Boom, and that was high base in the last couple of days. Boom, broke out again today for 3.7%. So. Ooh, doggies. Uh, I'm long in that one, so I just need to disclose that, but and have been for a while. Very happy. Just keep managing my stop on that one. So the question is, where is Dez? Well, Dez is, going, is out in California. He has another, you know, he's been helping out a fighter known as Ken Shamrock, for those of you who might not know it. And this weekend is the big rematch. That's right. Uh, Kimbo Slice versus Ken Shamrock. It's going to be on Spice TV. Dendez is going to be there. Uh, this was the fight that never happened uh, back in 2012. The two of them were supposed to fight, and two hours before the fight, Ken had to cancel the fight. So now this is a big rematch, and it's on free TV. That's right, Spike TV at, uh, I believe it starts at 9 o'clock Eastern Time, the ticket does, and this is the lead ticket. So uh, be looking for Dez. He's going to be sitting there in one of those front rows. And his Ken Shamrock takes on Kimbo Slice this Friday on Spice TV. 
Well, this is Mark the Meerkat suffering. Hey, just remember that it's not the news that counts. It's the market's reaction to the news. Just like today in the Fed announcement. Trade well.